Five two six five seven four. You got to. Play four, no, so. God, please, no, no. Okay. Yeah, you're not no! supposed to do that. No. It could be because of the sixty-eight bullet holes in his face too, but also, also. yeah. And then, and then the fact that there was no back. What's up guys, happy new year to everybody and welcome back to my channel. I figured I wanted to start the year with a nice chill investigative video and this is what we have right now. If you guys like the video, hit that like button, subscribe. Let's go down nice. here, we got two and I want calls. Somebody's talking about the LTD and Mega Mall and then somebody said it's been shot and somebody broke into their house. So, let's go on ahead back here. And... Um, <clears throat> I gotta figure out why this is doing this right here. Maybe it's the server version. Maybe that'll fix it. Seven twenty one to the unit arriving over eight four five. Uh, be advised, my vehicle's gonna be outside the building. There's also gonna be a blood shower coming from the front door to the back. Show 574 arrived at 845. 100, you can show me go around the back. Alright, let's go around the back over here and see if there's anything back here related to the call. This is the guy who said he's been shot. And house broken into. 721 on beige rise. I'm gonna have eyes on a times one unknown occupant down to this time. Alright, let's pop over up and over the fence right here. Uh, let's see here. Five two six one hundred. All right. Go ahead. Five two six. I believe this would qualify as extra circumstances for a search. Which house is it? It's at the back of eight five four eight four five. Don't worry, me. I'm on your left. Jump over the fence. It's to our right. Just over here to the body. They'd be advised the uh, individual at the back is going to be uh, at the C system. Alright, so they found the gun, door broken. Okay, so maybe uh, let's let's go ahead and search the house. Door Door is broken, signs of force entry. Let's go. Alright. You can't actually get in, by the way. I know, I know. Yeah. Actually, six at the front door. Are we going to enter from front or back? Be advised, me and uh, 100 at the okay. back side uh, moving in now. Eight four five. What do I find? A from. All right, let's go ahead and clear this. Mm, you won't be able to get in there. Yay. All right, so they found. We found a gun. We found the doors broken. Dead body. So for uh, medical, you can. Rolling at this time. Area's gonna be clear. Alright. So, from what it can look like, uh, chats. I do believe this is probably like some home invasion or something. So, um. You said home invasion? I'm thinking yeah. a home invasion gone wrong as well. We gotta figure yeah. out who this guy is, uh, if he's the homeowner or maybe the. Know somebody else? Yeah, I'm gonna. Um, we can get we could get some uh some fingerprints off the shell casings and that gun. Yeah, and see what what what, what happened. I'll get a, a unit as well to maybe see if anyone in the area knows of anything. Maybe the house next door. See when the shot goes off, everybody would put it in the area. Seven twenty one. If a unit can maybe check uh, the neighboring houses of this apartment or this uh, house, uh, see if they uh, notice anything, if they heard anything. 
574, be checking. Two photos of uh, casing and DB. Alright. Alright, so we're gonna go ahead and take some pictures here. Okay, so we've taken our photos. I'm gonna take the gun. I'm gonna take the gun to the station and see if I can get any get kind of station. DNA. Okay. Yeah. Seven oh three. We advise this uh, fellow's been chilling about forty minutes. Ten four. One hundred. I'm heading back to the station to run some diagnostic. Seven Did you take these shell casings as well? Uh, negative. I just took the the firearm, left the shell casing so you could take pictures of it. Okay. All right, we're gonna head back to the station. And see if we can get uh, some, like, some on this vehicle. Not the vehicle, but see if we can get DNA or anything from the gun. And then hopefully we can, we'll be able to find uh, some DNA, find an address. Go, go see what's, what's up with this person and their gun. See if it's, the gun's registered, all of that kind of stuff. Let's go ahead and head out. Five two six five seven four. You're good to put your good away, sir. Ten four. Yeah, you're not supposed to do that. Why is my APR is not working? Did we get any uh, information from any neighboring uh, civilians in the area? If they noticed anything? Negative, I've not come across anybody. 11011 uh, North Bond Crusade Road 833 on a Grand Color GT Occupied times one. Crashing Occupied Unknown. Uh, let me get a mark unit. All right, good day, sir. Robin, and down for me, please. Yeah, got you, Mr. Commissioner. All right. One second, I have a new car, you know. I got you. <laughs> All right, how you doing, sir? I'm doing pretty good. Commissioner Dev of the San Andreas State Patrol. Reasons for the stop, sir, is that, uh, you morphed into this vehicle from a Subaru just now in the middle of the road. Uh, let's let, let's make sure we're not doing stuff like that. Yeah. So it was it was just that yeah the Subaru was kind of having problems. You know, okay. Didn't have an engine. Yeah, let's make sure we're not morphing in the middle of uh of the road like that. Anybody can see you from anywhere. You understand that? Yeah, I sorry about that, sir. All right, let me get your license or insurance from insurance on you. Yeah, I got to one of those like pokeballs, you know. All right. Do you and do you also have uh, any weapons in the vehicle? Guns, knife, drugs, firearms, anything like that? Well, I mean, I work for the bail bonds company. I'm going down to my office, so I. Okay, know, so I, I got guns and tasers and stuff. Where, where's your license for the uh, licensed firearm? Where's the license for the firearm? Yeah, the registered firearm. Yeah. Okay. All right. Go ahead and sit tight for me. Where's that weapon at? It's on my leg. Okay. All right. Just sit tight for me. 729 be advised. I've just got a. Uh, Alright, we got a name. John Neal. Uh, the one who. John Neal. This is a felony. You shouldn't have a firearm.
Alright, sir. Unfortunately, I'm gonna have to ask you to step out the vehicle. Hello? Hello? Trooper, you can hear me, right? Yes, sir, I can hear you. Alright. Uh, my fault. Well, yeah, what, was, what was that, officer? Unfortunately, I'm gonna have to ask you to step out the vehicle, sir. Uh, okay. My come, come back over here in front of my vehicle. Go ahead and put your hands on the ram bar. Don't move. Alright, so I'm gonna actually be putting you under arrest at this time for possession of a firearm by felon. Okay? You have a, a, a convicted felony on your record. Which means... My, what's, what's my name? It's John Needle. That's the name I got. That that has a felon? Yes. You, you have a felony, what? sir. Impersonation of a police officer. How? When? What? I have, yeah, I have impersonation a... of a government employee. I'm seeing the arrest was uh, on the 25th of November, 2023. Cause of death will be consistent with gunshot wound actually, only. I, uh, uh, we'll be clearing really back like off, going to back to quarters. I don't really like to get arrested. I've never been arrested. In okay, well, at this point, it's on my record, so I'm going to have to do my job, okay? Just don't move. I'm going to go ahead and disarm you. Oh, okay. He takes firearm. Clears. Is loaded. Just his mail. Okay. One hundred. Can I get a ten fifty one out here to A three three Crusade Road for a gray and colored GTR? Alright, sir, at this time you have the right to remain silent. Anything you say and do can be used against you in a court of law. You have the right to have an attorney present during questioning. If you cannot afford one, one be appointed to you by the state of San Andreas. You understand his rights so have right to you today, sir? Uh, I understand, yeah. Okay. Once we are finished here, you can go ahead and uh, take it up with your, your governor, okay? Um, or your mayor with all of that stuff that arrests and everything and see if they can handle it handle it for you but for right now since our we are in the field and we are doing this right now i have to take you down to the station because of my what's on my record you understand that I understand. all right just come on and walk over here with me Poop that baby. yeah let's not do that please Alright. Alright, let's go ahead and search this vehicle. Alright, it was just a routine traffic stop, but this guy, he has a record on him. Um, pretty decent report right here. And we are gonna... I'm not gonna write the report because... Uh, apparently he doesn't know about this and I'm gonna let him go ahead and handle that for COC but for right now we are gonna arrest him for possession of firearm by felon and uh, that's what we're gonna do here um, I have to go off what my records say right, right now and um, yeah so nothing I am finding anything in here sir all right just stay with the car for me. I'm going to go take this guy down to the station. Stay with the car and uh, just tow it whenever the tow gets here. Yes, sir. All right. Thank you. you 100, you can show me. Uh, have one in custody. We're going to be heading 1019 to the station. Oh, my God. Oh, my door is open. All right. So, unfortunately for him, we had to do that because... What the fudge? Did that happen on your side too? I don't know, man. I don't know what talk about. You must be down. 721, be on the lookout for a Bravo mic. It's going to have black hair. You bugging. Uh, hair colors also. 
uh, yeah, the original writer this time is going to be involved into that uh, home invasion call. And name's going to be James. That's McCann. pretty nice Jeep. Where did I get the Jeep from, bro? Uh, can't say anything, sir. We got it from Jeep. I heard these Grand Cherokees Correction, like, dreads is going to be spiked. Have you said what? Your clutch is slipping? I feel like your clutch is slipping. Nah. 574, what's going like to be your location? We chilling. Oh, this is not here no more? That sucks. Hey, that was a good 026, who are you calling 574? I got shut down for not being very clean, but I got arrested here once again. Alright, one sec. Alright. 10-9. Uh, uh, right. Could you repeat who you're crazy. calling? I was calling uh, last uh, unit that was calling uh, out uh, suspect's uh, name. Yeah, that's gonna be a bow level. Stopped on a routine. 10 four. Take stop and after. 526-574. Could I get your location? Uh, 811 at this moment. Office. Little Her. Bighorn Avenue, 811. Right. He has. I can't be with you in a second, just hang tight. 10 4. Previous felony. Therefore, he is unable. To legally carry a firearm. All right, we're gonna go ahead and uh, that's our report here. Let's do the date. Is it twenty six? Drive Jail fifteen thirty Swabs Firearm for print related to the DBI Grove Street and I find any finger print. Alright. Let's check and see if he has any fingerprints on this on this thing. Alright, one hundred you can show me uh back to it. One hundred and seven two six there. Officer, watch out, yes, can. Get up, dude. I need a unit down here, one six zero. RC six pressing any additional unit available to post to one hundred from major structure fire. Break the gas up there. Let's keep uh, air clear for all of them. Maybe some traffic going. Get signal on any piece. I believe we have an officer down. Can I get you down to 160 Southwest, uh, Chile at night? 
Damn, he drug y'all all the way out here. He dragged y'all real far. Y'all good? Where's the suspect? He's right here. Ah, I don't see him. Oh. Are you have an officer hitting the vest? Yeah, I went through the vest. It's on, uh... I went straight through his house. 100. Can I get a medical out here? Uh, 160. I'm gonna put a little pressure on that gunshot. I'm gonna make sure there's no more blood leaking out, okay? Stop this bleeding. Medics here for you. All right, we got uh, medics here. GSW to his arm and chest. Uh, I'm not sure what the officer has. Okay, so we rolled up on scene. There was a pursuit and shooting going on. Um, now we here, but if I'm being honest, you said what? I got here real late. Couldn't see anything. Didn't know what was going on. So let me get my spot. So, uh, we rolled up, medicals are going on right here. 100, do I have anybody going for that MVA? 526, negative, we have no units available at this point in time. We got a station on fire, an MVA already in progress, and you'll stop. 10-4, I'm gonna head out to the MVA then. Alright, y'all got it, I got an MVA to go to. Oh, there goes my door. Well, definitely you didn't need that. Rickin, <laughs> you seven thirty one, I want you to respond to the SP station for the fire. I'll take the view. One hundred you can show me heading to one oh one for the MV. One hundred from five oh five on your own with the MV with you, sir. Can I? I'll be around with a ten four MV injury accident with you, sir. Ten four, I'm gonna be a few mics out. I gotta go get my door repaired. Oh, this thing is squarely So we're gonna go ahead, try to get to this MVA as quickly as possible. Ooh. This is squarely. I'm not gonna go that direction because I gotta gotta get to a mechanic shop. On my way, AI. On my way. Let's go. Somebody could be hurt. All right, so we're gonna stop at this mechanic shop up here, get our door repaired, and then we can we can slow down the speeds later. It's just that officers are kind of stretched thin right now, so that's why I'm trying to rush right now. We're gonna go to the other one up here. There you go. We got a door back.
I don't know where. Oh, there it is. Prefer driving on controller. I slow down speeds a little bit. to that MVA. For those who don't know, MVA means Motor Vehicle Accident. 505. So let's go ahead and head out. They said, I think they said it was under the bridge over here. So let's go under. I do need gas as well, but oh well. We'll see how things, how things go. So we want to at uh, 100 SP part. Engine to the very cheap. Didn't they say under the bridge? Let's look back at the 911 call. Somebody wants to me around to 101. Not 101. Engine due to Parkman. The bridge. I think I see it. I think I see it. I'm gonna need medical over here to 101 uh, on the side of the freeway. I got one vehicle crashed out, stuck in a tree. Uh, let's save the Bob, Bob, I'll be back ten eight. Anyone search that suspect's vehicle? Negative. Hello, can anybody hear me? Somebody wants a 100. Uh, can you throw down a flare? We're gonna be off the side of the freeway, exactly on 101, but on the uh, O'Neill Farm side. If you look off the side of the the bridge, you'll see us. I got my light on, spot spotlight on on the vehicle. Hello, can you hear me? Our 100 control, correction, 100 to fire. Engine 2 is currently investigating the fire at the station at 100. 10 4, do you have anybody else that can come to this? As of right now, say negative. 10 for a gym is gonna have to wait. He's pretty stuck right now. I can't get to him without having some tools. Vehicle's up on its side. Uh, he's trapped in there, and I see some major head ble head wound. He has major we uh, bleeding to his head. 10 for I believe control is most likely just gonna route you county medical. 10 for he he'll be fine. Alright, let's see if we can me attempts attempts to open door. Alright, let's see if we can open up this door, maybe pry it open and see if we can we can get him get him out. Door's jammed. 100, uh, can I get a unit to bring me a crowbar? Are they still looking, looking for me? God damn. God damn. God damn. What is that man doing? 
crazy. 100. Do you got one in your car? I believe so, but I'll need another one. All right, let's see if we can get this man out this car. Door's jammed. He is the window shattered. Me looks inside. Is the driver pinned to anything? Is the seat belt? So on. Am I able to see any? Am I able to see any? Um. Signs of. Breeze. Possibly to the neck and. Is that fire EMS? Yeah, it's fire EMS. Let's pause, what do I find? Alright, let's see if we can... I don't know what's going on here. This is what you call being a speeder. <laughs> you definitely... He definitely flew off the freeway. I'm gonna believe the postal is gonna be 101. You know you're speeding if you fly all the underneath the the, the pass. Like, yeah, this is bad. Yeah, this is this is ridiculous right here. He he had to been speeding. Had to have been. All right, what I got here? Both arms broken. Neck looks fine. Bloody chest. He's also got some um. Some uh, some also found a list of addresses. A head wound. He's been pinned by the seatbelt and something else inside the car. The doors jam and all windows are shattered. The car is teetering on the side on on that fence over there. And uh, there's also some materials leaking. So I would get a fire extinguisher is ready. I'll be back now. What I want. Never. One hundred batteries on fire. Oh my gosh! I did not see that. All right, 100. I got a small fire right here attempting to put it up. Oh my gosh. 100 fires grown. Uh, Eunice, go ahead and give give the uh, fire EMS some space. One hundred, can I get units to lock down the uh, southbound lanes of uh, traffic on the freeway? The fire has leaked onto the bridge. I see six lanes already shut. Turn that off. Golly, that's a big fire now. 100 fires going to be spreading at this time. User disconnected from your channel. Engine two fire command. What's your ETA? User left your channel. That's crazy. Fire spinning out of control. Uh, uh, we have a huge chemical fire now. Uh, huh? I'm going to need you to get This guy's my uh, witness for the arsenal over the station. That's crazy. I wonder what happened. I don't think he's going to be much use. I don't think he's going to make it. The station was provoked. 
by unknown means other than gasoline and a Molotov. However, the original call was for a robbery at the bank. That was fake. Followed by a call in that the station was on fire two to three minutes later. On arrival, he was stood on the embankment opposite side of the station. He told me he'd witnessed the mail in a blue car set the station on fire, similar to his car. Uh, huh. I told him to go down to the Blaine County station and we'd take his report there because it wasn't safe up where he was. And yeah. Then, uh, yeah. Then this happened. Not even what? Not even a mile away, he clearly crashed. Okay. Which is suspicious. Evidently. Uh, this is the fourth fire we've had that's been possibly arson but not confirmable. So, I don't know what's going on today, but well, somebody's having I guess a bit of fun. Everybody's in the arson fit right now. Yeah. yeah, when I saw the fire spreading, I already closed the bridge. I was going to call it in before you even had a chance. But, yeah. I got you. Well, got to it before you. <laughs> we closed the bridge. We just didn't call it and we closed it. Yeah. Why is besieging me or is there a deputy down there holding a hose lock? Um, there's a deputy holding a hose. I think he's in the wrong prof User left your channel. Oh, that's a big ass truck right there. Oh, wait. Oh, now oh, there's another one. I think it just had a baby. <laughs> and then it just had an abortion. Fire spread into the grass. User joined your channel. User joined your channel. Tells me that bridge is going to need shutting on both lanes at this rate. 526, can I get an additional two units down to 101 on the bridge? God damn, why are you so loud? We need you to close down the northbound lanes from Postal Zero. He's louder than eight. me! Nobody should be louder than me. God damn. Yeah, I'm gonna close both lanes before this becomes an obstruction of view issue. Yeah, I think it pretty much already has, though, if I'm being honest with yeah. you. Yeah. Fire engine, okay, so you're driving away like it's a normal day walking past it. That's a lot of fire, though. Jesus. Yeah. Five two six five oh five. We need fifty one. All right. So. They're still battling the fire. Sits. Can I get you guys routed to still trying to figure to out the north bounce north freeway due to that the guy is on the bridge. stuck in the vehicle. Hmm, look at this. Is he a mess news at that far? You throw airport fire and rescue. I think they're in the wrong country. <laughs> yeah, they are. That's an airport. Yeah, but I guess they didn't. They, they, the apparatus was needed. Tea spilled all over the, all over the horizon. Eh? I guess it was necessary. <laughs> is it just me or is that guy in a t-shirt and jeans pants? Yeah, uh, yeah. Don't ask. It's he was wearing his pajamas. Your channel. Huh. Yeah, Interesting. Anyway, it's the unis uniforms. It's the what? They take, it's the uniforms, they take a minute to pick one. You want, you want us to okay. close off the bank? They just keep changing them. Yeah. Let me go and see what these guys are doing. Alright. Alright. 7-5-1, radio check.
Well, this is a big fire that they have to um, try to put out. And we're gonna see how best they can do it. We gotta stay on scene until they ha until it's over, guys. Because I can't necessarily leave. I was here, um, and the guy was just he was just crashed out on the on the side of the the highway. I tried to stop the fire, but five two six. It um, didn't work uh, out that way. I guess. The opposite lane behind you, sir. The southbound lane is mixed, and it's the northbound lane. I want to push me back tonight, so you know. Got a barbecue, this is pretty decent. Yeah. A roast chicken in 10 minutes. It's really large, though. <laughs> That's what she said. That I was about but... to say. Most people like it that way. I think I saw Vix the barbecue today, then. Yeah. You have a name? Nope, didn't get a chance to. I was trying to get in the vehicle, but didn't even get a plate. Should have written that down before I went in, but I was just more focused on saving the guy's life. You're good. That's the chemical farm. Uh, Chain good. This room, that's to close all the roads. Huh? That's to close the other road as well, this right? Yeah. Underneath the bridge. I think I think they're getting it done though. It's getting smaller. Yeah. Slowly and surely. Surely slowly but surely I should say. Okay, so keeping these roads close for now. Let me see how we do. Big, big, big fire. Crazy how that works. Thank you, arrival on scene. Zero nine seven. Is you must need that zero nine seven? I think I'd invite them to water my plants in my garden. Uh, no, nah, they'll draw my plants, bro. Yeah. We took the long way around. I was uh, the call at one six zero then. Good, bad. One six zero. Yeah. Five point five on three. I got there really. Yeah. I didn't. I didn't. Uh, I didn't. Uh, see anything or hear anything. Oh, okay. Hey, yeah. What's going on? Uh, Not much. I just, mean, just, just, just baking right here. People. Yeah, what, this is a chat's idea of cooking. That's not my idea. <laughs> he said to me to do some brownies today, make some in the oven, and I said, sure, I'll be there in five minutes, and I came to this. Nope. Definitely the Brits idea, not mine. That white Heathrow Airport's there then? So you're saying Chad made the fire? Definitely the not. They tried to take off and they sent the British to deal with it. No, it was that reckless driver right there. I, I bet he got mm. bumped off the road is what I bet. I literally just got, got, got on duty, you know, so. I heard my brother got killed, so. Oof. Yeah, sucks. Oof. Yeah. Might need to do a funeral for him. Be interesting. Yeah. Hold on. If you're here, who's watching the southbound and North Carolina? I guess nobody. There's, there's cars. Probably right the there. person sitting in the car. Okay, so someone is in the car. Is that what? Saying. It's probably the person sitting in the car. 
There is a person standing in the car. Oh, uh, he, he definitely dead now. I gave that away. Well, I think smell a the barbecue fact, or the fact that he's still in the... The fact that I can smell burning flesh from here. Bravo, public 1074, you guys have a great night. I think that's a battery fire and we're putting water on the car now. User disconnected from your channel. Damn. Okay, well, looks like they're getting out. I'm opening up lanes of traffic again. Five two six. we can open lanes of traffic on the north and south band of postal 101 and 098. Nah, that was crazy. Okay. We're gonna go ahead and... Move my vehicle. All right, relax, AI, relax. Jesus, y'all be, y'all be tripping for no reason. I do need to go ahead and head to a. Yeah, so it's UPS driver, so. Yes, okay. Yeah, I got called UPS driver. Oh. Crazy. All right, let's go get some gas. All right, 100, you can show him back to net. All right, let's head back to net. We're going to go and get some gas. Fuel up a little bit. And uh, keep going here. 100, you can show me on a scene at 044. All right, what's going on here? Uh, there's a car on the roof. <laughs> that's uh, the, that's how, the best way to explain it. How you even got a car on the roof? Um, that's a good question. Uh, we still haven't figured that one out. Is he giving y'all yeah, problems? He has a he has a uh, uh, holster on his right, so that's why I'm kind of staying behind my vehicle right now because I don't know what's up with right. that. I'm gonna bring the beer cat beer back. Okay. are disconnected from your channel. Five twenty five one oh one, he's coming down. Ten four. Two to the fire units. Leave that ladder uh, up there so I can go search that vehicle. Mm. I want to get down that ladder. from 05. Go ahead. Yeah, thank you. FD. Can I have FD move their truck out of the way, please? <laughs> Negative, it's not necessary. Hey, uh, for that Bearcat tow truck wannabe, let's just uh, get our fire apparatus out of the way first. I beg your pardon? We're going to move our apparatus. Once our apparatus gets out the way, you can get closer. You don't need, you don't need to move it. Uh, one on one, would you like me to go up there and drive the vehicle down? Stand by. Step off the truck really quickly, please. 
eight. Can I have a unit run up twenty eight? Who's close up there so I can get a twenty eight, please? All right. So to solve this issue, we got the beer cat out here um, to get the officers up to a, a higher standing point. Um, let's do SSP beer cat ladder or ramp. Let's do ramp. And now let's go ahead and do this. Figure out why that guy's car is up there and what's going on here. It looks very uh, futuristic. So, uh, what's your name, bud? My name? Yeah. Mikey. You got an ID on you? Yeah. Can I have your ID for me, please? There you go. Alright. Sit down. Huh. I'm trying to figure out how. Uh, I don't know, sir. I just walked here. Trying to figure out how a carp got up there in the first place. So I don't know, man. You know, you know. Uh, I seen a wee woo. It was the thing in the air, like. <laughs> And then land at that thing, and I'm like, oh my oh god, my god, that was nuts. Did you see anybody get up the vehicle? Uh, no. I just got here. Mm, okay. If you say so, sir. Um, wh where, where did that thing come from, Chad? What do you mean, where did it come from? I, I haven't seen that before, and it's pretty cool. Uh, that's because there was no need for it. So until now, <laughs> I mean, you have a good point. We don't come across many cars on buildings, but and we don't come across having to use this in general. So that's what? True. What is that futuristic thing? Like you got two futuristic vehicles here. You got that one. And you got that one. What? What is Wait, that? Which, plane which one are you talking about? That one. Why fit with the flashy lights? What do you mean futuristic? Oh, what is that little uh, walkie walkie thing that's all lifted up? Is that a tow truck? It's not a tow truck now. Uh, it's for SWAT officers to access areas that they wouldn't otherwise have access to. Instead of us using oh. a fire truck to get up there, we can use our own vehicle. Y'all rich. Let me hold some money. You're not rich. Maybe it's the State Department, but you're uh, not rich. See all them tickets that they be writing? Gotta go somewhere. Ah, right, there you go, bud. So, uh, how did you exactly get on the roof? Uh, my friend, uh, oh, you know. Oh, my lord. Click. Uh, used a little uh, forklifting thing that lifted me up there. Where is it at now? Uh, he rolled off in it. Use your friend. What's his name? Uh, Who's he go by uh, 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 his nickname. Uh, uh, All right. Get up on the top here. Interesting car. Find anything? Uh, just the vehicle documents. I'm uh, trying to see what it, documents state on it because uh, I don't really understand what vehicle documents are supposed to be right now. Okay. So I'm trying to get what it, documents state um, the vehicle it belongs to Hector Gonzalez, which has three warrants, two for first for murder. First degree murder, and yeah, I don't know. If that 52, we're already on scene of the secondary run. 044. Four. That's the speeding car. Very 
Hey, if we once we get it down to the ground, we can uh, I can run the dog around it. All right, y'all want me to drive it down here, down the Bearcat? It's not gonna fit. <laughs> I and believe it will. Down. It'll. It will. It there, will. They, it has handlebars. It's not gonna. It's and not it's gonna fine. fit. It's, it's fine. fine. It's not gonna fit. That's cool. jank as hell. Y'all ain't destroying my beer cat. I just got this thing outfitted. Hell nah. Find all another right, way. I, I vote one of y'all. I vote one of y'all just drive it down. It'll be all right. I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm joking. <laughs> Yeah, actually, it was yeah, Alright, so yeah, how no. are we gonna get this thing down? Is it like a permanent decoration I mean, I right now, or what? Good, yeah. Oh, you go there and you press this help. I know how to work it out. We should get a helicopter or something, I don't know. Not a helicopter, they're probably just gonna push it off the roof or something. I mean, it's hard. Mm -hmm. Alright, well, Andrew, you can show me going and back to station. Five two six. I'm gonna quest to with the ability to access a roof to pull off the vehicle from the roof. You gonna need a crane, my boy. Let's go ahead get the explorer out. Haven't used this in a while. Should hmm. I use this though? You're, you're in that is the question. You need back ten eight off the of call at two four four. Hello, Maple Sir. Oh, what's going on? Doing pretty good. How about you? Nice uniform. Thank you. I'll make no sure problem. to tell the tailor. No problem. I was just uh, telling my uh, engineer here, great job on that technical extraction work. Thank mm -hmm. you very much. Sir. Thank you. I need a raise. Yeah, no, you don't. Um, yeah, me too. Ain't happening. I don't know, you just got on the job talking about race? Come on now. I'm a whole engineer, sir. I'm not a probationary. <laughs> okay, Mr. Engineer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whatever yeah, that I'm means. I mean, I was trying to make it sound fancy. Basically, I, basically I told him when to move the ladder and when to stop moving the ladder, and then another person went up on the ladder, and he, he kind of just sat in the cab. Oh, so he didn't really do anything. Got right, you. right. It takes a lot of critical <laughs> training to know how to operate the ladder, sir. Right, 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 right. I've, saw, right. I've seen some fighter friends get attacked by their, by their trucks, so... Right, 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 right. right, right. Yeah, and you look, you look someone like the you, but... Me? Yeah, me? That, that's that's, that's kind of impossible uh, right now. Go ahead and send me no, one. I, I, he looked like... I didn't say it was you. He looked like... I'm not saying that it was me either. I'm He's just saying it's impossible to look like me. I'm one of a kind. Unique. Yeah, you look like one of our volunteers. Yeah. Volunteer, interesting, interesting. Whatever happened to him? <laughs> uh, he joined the uh, SASB. Oh, really? What's his name? Yeah. Five two six. Is anyone looking? Uh, for I know his last anymore? name was Dev. Really? Yeah. That's strange, cause that's my last name. Yeah, you know he really? looked just oh. like you. So really? That, that, yeah, that that oh, nose crazy. looks familiar. Oh but, no, I got a know, pretty unique he nose. He made four career choices, so you know. Oh, he did. Why do you say that? Uh, I mean, he could have been right here. I mean, no look like y'all doing nothing. <laughs> yeah, I'll take that over getting shot at. And I like the action, the fun. Right, right, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, he was, this man was dangling off a ladder a minute ago. Yeah, well, that's not action. It's not fun. It's not like as <laughs> adrenaline dumping is getting bullets flying at you. Like, imagine yeah, fully automatic. Imagine dying, though, you know? 
I mean, I got y'all to come and save me. <laughs> I mean, I, I guess. Oh, well, you, you see what a hurry we're in. <laughs> yeah, well, yeah. yeah. I mean, maybe them, not me. I only put out five. I don't, I don't say much. <sighs> okay. Sure. Yeah. If you say it's so, sir. crazy because there was, oh, there was a really is... high ranking guy that got shot like last night, I think. Even. Yeah, yeah, I heard about he that. Crazy. I, 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 no. I heard the news. Yeah. It was really awful because probably half the reason was that they didn't code for the scene fast enough. It just dragged on forever. I'm just sitting down the road watching the man bleed out on the highway. Yeah. Well, it could be because of the 68 bullet holes in his face, too. But Also, also. Yeah. And then, and then the fact that there was no backup for a good like three minutes, even though he called yeah, for mean, backup. Be, from what I, from what I saw from the expertise of people, um, he he tried to you know cool do all that without backup to let's... begin with. He would well, they what? Area. He tried to like you know pull over someone. So that's what I saw in the news. He tried to pull over someone in a remote area with a backup. Well, that's what happened, that's not entirely true because I'm pretty sure that as soon as he got the vehicle stopped, he called for backup. Oh, well, yeah, well, you know, um, I don't know. I'm just saying, and it it just Christmas, Christmas music and shit while you were dying on the news. You know, it, it, it <laughs> the news are don't bad, yeah, bro. I know, I know. We don't, they it don't bad. Some departments have this policy where you call out for backup while you're just kind of casually tailing them. And then pull them over. Yeah, exactly. I, I I'm pretty sure. Them, I, I mean, them. I mean, I, I would expect that as soon as somebody says, "Oh, this is a 1080 or this is a, a pursuit," there's automatically backup coming, though. So, and then if you oh, make call outs, they should bad. know that that's going on. I I must. I thought you were initiating a 1011. My bad. I mean, it's still mm -hmm. technically a 1011, even though, like, you know. Uh, it turns into a pursuit. It's just that person took an extended period of time to pull over. Oh, so was it a 1011 or a 1080? Well, it had to have been a 1080. But at oh. the end of the day, if you if you if you run from police, you stop. Mm -hmm. It's still technically a stop at the end of the day. It could be a felony, whatever it yeah, might be. So, but yeah, so after yeah, you know, sir, yes, I mean, I have a brother who's a law enforcement. But he's even if, but even if you. But even if you pull the per like, even if the person stopped and you got a gun out at them, it, that's technically not a, a a traffic stop. That's 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 felony. So yeah, felony from the time from the time he says 1080, backup should have already been on their way. And if he asks for backup even after they stopped, then it's still yeah. You know, I I don't see him doing anything wrong in that situation. Yeah, he just well, got caught. You joined your channel. I mean, yeah. I mean, I saw from what I saw in the news. Uh, the guy just. Died randomly a, a quote-unquote felony stop alone usually you need backup for that you know yeah but if the person if the person is is um not presenting any signs of being dangerous at the beginning and you know you have backup on the way there's nothing wrong with starting whatever you have to start well, I mean, I guess you're right, but... As I said, he just got you caught you somehow. More, somehow, yeah, you could, you can never know because somehow, some way, a random firearm just appeared out of nowhere. I watched that dash cam footage. A yeah. random firearm just appeared out of nowhere and got his ass. So, I mean, you can't necessarily blame him for, for doing his job. Sounds like a skill issue, really. Plus, the person just didn't didn't really have a reason to, anyways. Yeah. Well, now he's a six feet under. Well, that's unfortunate. unfortunate. Yeah, it, it really is unfortunate. Life happens. Anyways, time for me to go catch some speeders and hopefully not get shot. All right. Stay safe out there. Bye bye. <laughs> a w conversation. <laughs> Crazy. Ready or not never ceases to amaze me with all of the recent changes to the game. Recently, I've been playing through the campaign or command.